Hey everybody, want to do a demo. I'm selling my uh, Akai GX77. Don't want to, but I need the money. Uh, it's in really nice shape. Everything is working. I'm going to do a demo. There's, uh, I don't even think that's a, a scratch. There is uh, a couple of scratches here, and then uh, in the top there's a, there's a nick. But everything else looks really nice on this. All the aluminum everywhere. Uh, looks pretty nice. There are a couple words uh, and a couple of the things uh, missing here where it says, uh, I believe that's supposed to say line and the X on the Max is missing. It's not perfect. It's even part of the R on Master. But other than that, the, the brushed aluminum is all in, in near mint shape. I've had to sing for a few years and actually I put new belts on it and cleaned the pots up. Uh, the pots and switches with uh, deoxid. And it all works pretty nice. Take much from my record player. Now this thing has an adjustable bias, and if I had the uh, the right receiver, this receiver is a problem because when I change the inputs, it changes the output to the to the record output. I'm probably doing something wrong, but man. So right now I'm recording, and this is what you hear coming off of the record. I'll play this back here in a minute. Recording forward. This is a quick reverse. It's got two, if anyone doesn't know the 77, it has uh, six heads. Six heads in here. The tape actually gets drawn up against the heads through here. Right now, this pinch roller is the only one uh, in operation until I reverse it. That's a quick reverse, still recording, and now this, this pinch roller is driving everything going to screw up my playback, but that's okay. okay. Alright, let's see what we did. The sound quality is really pretty nice on here. Again, my record player is uh, in need of service, but uh, what can you do? Uh, my take-up reel here is, is absolutely bent to hell, uh, but again, it's the reel. I think the spindles do wobble a tiny bit, but uh, they're certainly not really bent. So there's some fast-forward, rewind. And it's all just, just one touch stuff. From Florida, a daily show with John Stewart at the Republican Network. That was me recording from the TV. This has uh, reverse selectors, uh, kind of typical of these things. You can go straight forward, you can, or you can reverse once, or you can do a constant loop. You can also set this thing when it, if you were to have this on a power, you know, uh, uh, the 110 outlet, if you had it on a, um, like a lamp timer. Uh, when it turns on, you can set it to start recording or to start playing, which is kind of a neat feature, too. There's individual controls for the line in and then a master, and, uh, and I think I mentioned this. It's a, this has a front bias adjustment, so if you if you were recording, and I, again, I can't do it because I, I don't know what I'm doing with this new stuff, um, but if you were listening to your recording at playback, you can adjust the bias to for 
however you like it, you know, whatever your taste is. Counter works. Everything is really good on this thing. It's a really nice, uh, really nice deck. These are some of the last ones they did. <clears throat> So that is about it. There is a loading, a roller, a loading up and down. I, I did have to clean this. The uh, I think one of the problems these things get is there's a uh, there's a cam wheel inside here. That's that's almost crazy to get to. But uh, there's a cam wheel in here that drives this thing up and down. And if that freezes and the cam wheel won't turn, you could hit these things and you'll, all you hear is clicking. It's a pretty common issue with these. Um, anyway, six head, let me read the front here. It's a GX77 four track stereo tape deck. And it has a glass and crystal ferrite heads on there, by the way. Uh, feather touch logic control. It's got three motors, one, one for each reel, and a main drive motor that runs both the cap stands. Actually, the, the, both the cap stands are running at the same time. It's just depending on the direction, uh, is whether or not. Which, which roller is driving. Anyways, I'm just rambling. I appreciate you looking. I hope you enjoy it. Take care, everyone. Thanks.